Hey, what is up, guys? This is Solon Martin Tristan here, and I'm going to talk about my first time sneaking out. Now, if you want to see my first kiss, the link is in the description below. That was the very first episode of this, my first series. All right, guys, so let's get right into it. So let's start with the night of. So in my area, there is, like, this skating rink, and people would go there, you know, just to kind of hang out. And so, you know, I would go there to get women, and it actually worked. They ended up dating like four women or so there within like a few months time but that's a different story so <laughs> um so i went there and this one night um i met this girl and i had just met her and then i was like leaving she's like what you're not gonna give me a goodbye kiss i'm like what 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 so she had already given me her number so i'm like why not so i kiss her and then i leave and then so i was texting her that night and then either she yeah, I'm pretty sure she asked me because she was pretty forward about this kind of thing. But she was like, do you want to go out with me? And I'm like, yeah, you seem pretty chill. <laughs> slut, slut, slut. That's the slut alert going off. So um, either way, that's not really a part of the story. I, uh, sad face. Um, so I was like, yeah, sure, why not? I mean, you seem pretty chill. I mean, you know, we can have a good time. And she, I was texting her that night. And one of my buddies was at my house. And you'll probably hear about him in later stories because... He was there with one of the other stories, too. It was pretty chill. So he's, he's a pretty good friend of mine. And we were chilling at my house. And I was probably, mind you, yeah, around 13. I was in the seventh grade. And so I was texting this girl. And she's like, you know, I miss you. We should hang out tonight. And I'm like, hang, hang out tonight? I, I, I don't know what you mean. And she's like, you know, I should, I should, we should sneak out and see each other. And she was with her friend as well. And so we were chilling at my house. And she was way across town so um i was texting her and i'm like all right that sounds good i mean i've never snuck out before it sounds really fun i want to meet up with you and she's like you know we can make out and stuff <laughs> so um and this was not my first time making out so there's there was that and so she texts me and it was a friday night just so you guys know i mean oh i know tonight's friday night it's pretty solid right so she texted me and she was like, okay, so I want to meet up with you. <laughs> so she wanted to hang out really bad. I'm like, all right, you know, I can't really turn down this opportunity. No. <laughs> uh, okay, so I, my friend and I are like, okay, so this sounds good. So I start texting her and then she leaves her house and it's probably, mind you, what? two in the morning i don't know it was pretty late in the morning early in the morning whatever you want to call it a pff, whatever floats your boat so it's pretty early in the morning and so we set out to a park next to my house and uh, so we're waiting at that park for a long while and it was really sketchy so, <laughs> so like one of my friends like brought a bat because like people really weird people are out that late and it was so sketchy. So we wait there for like half an hour. And it turns out she went to the wrong park because, I don't know, this park didn't exactly have a name or I didn't know the exact name of it. So she went to a different park that was way far away. And she still had to go a really long way to get to the park that we were at. So we're like, okay, so let's let's go home. And we go home and everything was fine. So we're going. And the loudest part was, oh my god, was the door. Every time, if you've ever snuck out, you know what I'm talking about. But the doors are like ten times louder. That means that one of it is to do at night and there's less noise just all around. But the other part is it's like somehow there's some mechanics in the door. They're like, yeah, so I'm going to build this door. But at nighttime, when the little teenagers are trying to sneak out, they'll go, ee, 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 ee. So that's exactly what happened. But we managed to cope with it. And I had a house key, so we locked it after to not look suspicious. And, um, it's funny because my brother was right upstairs and we were chilling in the living room. So we just leave. And so, yeah, that that's before. So then we ended up coming back after waiting for like half an hour. It was freezing cold outside. So I was like, oh, God, I want to be here. You know, this would be so legit. And she had her friend. So he wasn't a third wheel. And neither of them were third wheels. And it was just amazing. It was a double pair of third wheels, which makes a motorcycle, I guess. I don't know. Whatever you guys want to call it. So... We go back to the house and we're like, all right, so let me know when you're getting close. So she texts us. She's like, we're getting close. So we go there and we wait for about 15 minutes and her and her friend finally show up. We see him way down, you know, like the road and we're like, oh my God. So we start walking towards him and I give her a huge hug and I'm pretty sure she kissed me. So we, we were just hanging out and then we were like walking around and uh, around the park and around houses nearby and she's like, ah, I gotta get back home, and stuff like that, so I was like, okay, so, she's like, 
she's like, do you want to make out with me? I'm like, yeah, of course I do. Why not? So I make out with her. And, oh my god, we got my friend and her friend to kiss. And it's funny because my friend wanted to kiss this girl because she was really hot. And my, my, I guess, girlfriend at the time. Yeah, my girlfriend at the time was pretty hot too. And so I kiss her. I'm actually making out with her. And then my friend... <laughs> My friend and her friend kiss, and it was so funny because she did not want to, like, at all, and we're just like, come on, just do it, why not? So I bet she hated him, and then I ended up getting both of their numbers, and, um, so my relationship with this girl that I snuck out with lasted about 24 hours, and there's some more stories to come about that, but anyway, so... Yeah, I make out with her, and then my friend kisses her friend, and then she departs on her way back home. And I guess she got lost that night, because it was like 5 in the morning when she was still trying to get home, and then her dad found out, and he had to pick her up. It was so funny, because she went the wrong way and got lost. I don't know, I guess she was really tired or stupid or something. But, yeah, and then we ended up breaking for a reason I will talk to you guys about later. But, I really hope you guys did enjoy this story, and kind of that little cliffhanger thing at the end about my first time sneaking out, if you've ever snuck out snuck out i i don't know man weird grammar stuff if you've ever snuck out before then please let me know in the comment section below i'd like to hear you know what went down and what your reason was behind it because i'm not gonna sneak out walk to the stops like yeah and then like run back because that is not that's not cool at all it has no you know merit it has no value or anything like that so really hope you guys did enjoy and i'll see you later